Is it time to check the ham yet? Yeah, it's been about two hours. Good. After you spread the brown sugar on, put some of that pineapple on top. <laughs> Florence, aren't you forgetting something? Huh? Oh, yeah, put a few of them little cherries on top, too. <laughs> I mean, aren't you forgetting who the cook is around here? Oh, that's okay, Miss Jefferson. I don't mind if you help out. <laughs> Would you mind getting the door, Florence? Oh, no, of course not. I'll get it. Gee, y'all don't let me do nothing around here. <laughs> George Dusty! <laughs> hey, cousin! Hey, Dusty, Dusty, how about that? Dusty, Dusty! <laughs> hey, guess who's in here? Don't tell me. Dusty. <laughs> Dusty Jefferson, I don't believe it! I don't believe you, honey! <laughs> hey, when are you gonna dump this turkey and run off with me, huh? <laughs> Florence, this is George's cousin! Hi. Hi. Hey, Weezy, Dusty ain't just my cousin, he's my main cousin. We were tighter than brothers, right, Dusty? You got it, George. Hey! <laughs> yeah, when we was growing up, I used to tell everybody we was twins. Really? <laughs> Dusty, were you that ugly as a child? Yeah, but I improved. Oh. <laughs> Come on, Florence, let's go get dinner ready. Okay, Miss Jefferson, and I'll make sure you do it right. <laughs> Boy, we sure had some great times, didn't we, George? Yeah, man. They can take a lot away from a man, but they can't take away his memories. Right. <laughs> hey, I remember the time you saved my skin. When was that? Well, you know, you lent me that hundred bucks to buy Weezy her engagement ring. Anybody would have done that, George. Yeah, but you're the only one who did it. And you know something? With all the money we got today, Weezy still hangs on to that old ring. Really? You know, Matt, it's been quite a while, but you're still looking good. Yeah, you're looking good, too, Doug. Well, <laughs> maybe on the outside. Well, nobody looks good on the inside. <laughs> Especially me. Remember that uh, automobile accident I had? Yeah. Messed up one of my kidneys. Oh, yeah. Well, you still got the rest of them, don't you? <laughs> George, a person only has two kidneys. Well, one out of two ain't bad. You're still batting five, huh? <laughs> well, except now that kidney's going bad. I have to go to dialysis three times a week. You gotta go to Dallas, Texas three times a week. <laughs> Not Dallas, dialysis. It's a, it's a machine that they hook me up to. It takes the place of my kidney. Cleans my blood. Ooh, that's a drag. Yeah, especially when you're on the road a lot selling. I may have to look for a new job. Well, look, you ain't gotta look no further. If it's a job you want, you got it. <laughs> well, I tell you, there is something I need from you, George, but it ain't a job. Hey, look, if it's money. Oh, George, I don't need money. Well, whatever I got is yours. <laughs> Honest? Just that. <laughs> well, how about giving me one of your kidneys? Oh, <laughs> 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 you know, that's, for a minute, I thought you were serious. <laughs> I'm serious. I need a kidney transplant. Are you jiving? You want me to give you one of my kidneys? No, George. No, George, your kidney's down here. <laughs> you really want my kidney? Believe me, George, I hate asking this. Not as much as I hate hearing it. <laughs> but my only other choice is to wait until somebody dies and donates a kidney. Oh, well, cheer up. People dying all the time. <laughs> but I have to find one that matches mine. Oh, I'm sure ours ain't gonna match. Look, you six feet tall, I'm only five foot six. <laughs> no, George, what I mean is, is we stand a good chance of matching because we're closely related. Yeah, but Dusty, man, I ain't never had an operation in my life. I didn't even go to the hospital when I was born. <laughs> it's pretty simple to remove a kidney, George. It's just snip, snip. Snip, snip, ooh. <laughs> Look, George, I know what I'm asking is pretty heavy, and if... If you don't want to do it, I'll understand. Look, I didn't say I didn't want to do it. But asking somebody for a kidney ain't like bumming a cigarette. <laughs> now, look, why don't you think about it for a while, okay? Now, if you decide to do it, you call Dr. Feller at Manhattan Medical Center. He'll give you a, a blood test to see if our kidneys match. Here's his phone number. Mm, thanks, Dustin. Uh, and if you want to call me, I'll be staying in Brooklyn with my brother Bob. Bob? Hey, that's right. Why don't you ask Bob to give you a kidney? Well, he can't. He's got diabetes. Damn. <laughs> he always was lucky. <laughs>